Yeah, you know, the start of the game I thought was very good the first quarter. I thought we struggled uh, to start the second quarter. Down four at the half. Third quarter was pretty good. Uh, although we, you know, we, we gave them rhythm. Uh, and then obviously the fourth quarter uh, was poor. Yeah, uh, both, you know, you, and the thing is, is you got, you know, I think we were outscored 31 to 19 in the second. So that was a problem. Then we got going offensively, but our, our defense was poor in the third. And then, of course, the, the fourth was, was not very good. So we have to figure that out. Well, you know, there's, you know, he shoots it deep, and so it, we have to understand that he shoots it deep. You know, like it's, he's probably three feet beyond the three, and so you have to close and have an awareness as to, you know, what we're doing. And that's what we have to take a look at is the, you know, the it's more, you know, game plan mistakes that have to be corrected too. It's, that's, that's the concerning thing. It's they, they're going to make some shots where you you know you do it well and they can make those shots. They're going to take a lot of they're going to take forty you know plus threes, and they have the ability to make even when they're challenged well. But you have to have the discipline to keep doing it and then wear on them. And so, if you close short or you know you got one guy not doing what he's supposed to be doing, it's going to be bad for everyone. Uh, I don't know if I'm disappointed. I'm disappointed in our team. And uh, from this standpoint of, you know, to, you know, to when you're playing a team like that, you have to come in with an edge, you know. And part of it was we didn't make shots. We, you know, we we didn't shoot the three well, particularly, in, you know, in the first half. And I thought we had a lot of good plays, and we can't allow that to sap, you know, our energy. And so, that was probably the the most disappointing thing. And. It, you know, if we hit a lull offensively, that's when we're going to get in trouble if we don't play defense. You know, so um, that that's probably uh, the biggest thing. And you know, for every player, you're not going to shoot great every night. And when you don't shoot great, you got to do other things. You know, play great defense, get some rebounds, make some hustle plays, get into the open floor. Uh, and I think sometimes you, you get a couple of easy baskets like that that can get you going. You know, so. Uh, you know, I, I, we didn't play our best for sure, and, that, and I thought they played really well. Why do you think your defense, for quite a ways into the season now, is noticeably better than the first quarter than the other? Yeah, you know, it's and that's the challenge. The challenge is to play, you know, for 48 minutes, and you can't, you know, pick and choose, you know, when you're going to play it. And so that's probably the biggest thing. It's you know to be. You have to develop a mindset to do it and also have an awareness as to what's going on in the game. If someone gets going, you know, you have to react accordingly and you have to concentrate. And, you know, sometimes it's, you know, it's, it's as simple as, you know, how we're sliding. You know, if we're loping, you're not, you're not going to be, you know, in position to react and make the right play. And if you're a half step behind, that's all, that's all it takes in this league. And so, and there has to be a physicality to it. And uh, I think we're still learning that. Well, I, you know, the thing is, attention to detail, it's, you know, there's always two things you ask yourself, you know, whatever your scheme is. You're, the first thing is, are you doing it hard enough? And then are you executing it correctly? And those are, you, you always ask those two questions. And so, and, you know, if the answer is, yeah, you, you are doing it hard enough and you're executing it correctly, then it's time to change the scheme. You know, so there, you, and there are times you have to do that. But oftentimes, if, if, it come, if the answer is to one of those two questions is you're not doing it hard enough or you're not executing it correctly, then you can't just change because all you, you're going to, whatever you change to, you're not going to do that well either. So I think the discipline that's necessary, we have to continue to build on that. We've got to work at it. I thought Teague was terrific. I mean, yeah, no. Yeah. Could he do that every game, or is it just something where situationally? Yeah, no. I thought I thought he was really, really aggressive, and I thought he's been 
a lot more aggressive in in our recent games, which is good. You know, I think he's healthy again, so that's a good sign. I want him to continue to attack like that. I think it puts a lot of pressure on people. Yeah. Well, that's their, you know, that's their thing, and so our thing is, you know, we got we have to score the way we score, you know, and uh, you know we've been a high-scoring team to give up 120, you know, five, 26 points. Hey, you know, it's going to be hard to win like that, you know. But if you if you go back and you know in, over the last ten, we basically have been averaging the same amount as, as they have, except we score differently. You know, they score one way, we score another way. And so, like, we started off the, the first quarter was, was good. The second quarter was not, wasn't good. You know, we gave up what we had built up in that first quarter. But then we scored 30 in the, in the third. You know, so um, if you're scoring like that, you know, you, you should be in position to win. And obviously, you know, covering the line is something that, you know, you have to do well against these guys. You, you can't. You can't close short against these guys, that's for sure.